Adventure Summers. I had a long time no see. Um, I haven't actually posted a very many videos, even though I said I would. And I'm sorry about that. Also, sorry if this video is kind of shaky. I don't have my tripod with me. Um, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I am home for the weekend. Um, and I haven't been able to make, like, videos because I've been so busy. Um, so I guess this is just going to be, a, like, a little update on my fish. Um, yes, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so if my fit, my tank is still empty, I'm probably going to put like a little thing in there uh, because the fish seem kind of bored. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> uh, so I came home uh, and the first thing I noticed was this right there is uh, still very floaty. Apparently she was better. Um, and then... This guy, his eyes have been very clear. I don't know if you'd be able to see them, but he has amazingly clear eyes. It's actually very gorgeous. And yeah, and Charles and um, Plack are doing amazing. My battery's gonna die. Great. Great start. <laughs> so the other thing I noticed was in Rex. Um, if he turns around, he has like a white spot on him. I don't know, like, if you'd be able to see that right there. He's kind of dark and the light doesn't really show very much. Um, I think it's like a scale, like an overgrown scale, I guess. Um, but it's like white and mushy kind of looking. So you can see it right there. I think it's like one of his scales are falling out and it just hasn't fallen out yet. And I don't know really weird. I tried to pick it out and then it just started bleeding and it won't like come out. Um, so yeah, the first thing, well, the second thing I did was did a, um, 55% water change. Um, I didn't clean the sides or anything because they seemed fine. Um, but I did, um, put some Prazi, Aqua Prazi in it. And then I'm just gonna write in like my little instructions for whoever's taking care of my fish that day. I'll just write in the instructions that, um, to give them prazi, aqua prazi every, every week, I guess, until symptoms of things disappear. It's just precautionary, nothing too serious. Um, yeah, and also my automatic feeder died, <laughs> so I had to replace it, and all the food inside was clumpy. It's very dark in here, I'm sorry about that. So like, you know how there's like food inside and stuff. Um, you definitely won't be able to see that. But there's like food inside and the food inside was all like clumped together. So I just uh, threw it out and put some new food in there. And I changed the battery so now they're, it's working perfectly fine. And every week I just get whoever's taking care of my fish that week to press the button. To make sure it's still working, and then if it's not, then I'll give them instructions on how to fix it, or potential ways on how to fix it. So yeah, uh, they've been getting um, blood worms and brine shrimp once a week. Also, some veggies like cucumbers and spinach and whatever they feel like giving them that, that week. Um, as well as seaweed and uh, fruit once in a while. <laughs> Yeah, they've, they've been getting spoiled. Um, they do seem really bored, so I'm probably going to put like some decorations in there or something. And yeah, I guess that's it. Um, and I also forgot, um, and I for some reason can't get on my other YouTube account. So if you just see me rant, uh, post like a random video of something on this channel, just you don't have to watch it, just skip over it. But to the people that do want to watch it, go right ahead. I'd uh, be more than happy to watch it. And yeah, I guess that's it. Um, if you like the video, please subscribe, please like, and please comment. And I hope you have a great night. And I'll see you next time. Bye.